Right, so we're using a few creatures here that we've been learning about, but we're not learning about them. We're going to be learning about our body and how our body works. And a special part of our body is our senses. Now, it's not like a hand or a foot. Our senses tell our body, tell our brains about the world around us. It's almost like reading the world. And today we're going to discuss the sense of sight. Our eyes give us the sense of sight. So we can understand the world through what we see. And we're going to see how clever our eyes are. Because our eyes take photographs of things and they tell the brain. And then our brain has to sometimes remember what they saw. So it's easy if I take these creatures off and I just say, there's a scorpion, there's a lizard, have a look and tell me, what did you see? Because your eyes watching, a scorpion and a lizard. But now we're going to play a funny game. It's called Kim's Game. And I don't know why it's called Kim's Game, but we always played it when I was a little girl. So I need you to have a look. I'm going to trick you. I'm going to put, and I'm not saying what it is, we are only looking. Can you see there two creatures? Now I'm going to cover them. Use your sense of sight to look. And now your eyes can't see them anymore. Can you tell me what's under this cloth? That's right, let's look. Did you get it right? The locust and the spider. Excellent. Now I'm going to put three there. The locust, the bee, and the lizard. Have a good look with your eyes. Now I'm going to cover it. Who is in the tray? Tell me one. The locust, the bee, and the spider. Shall we have a look? The locust, the bee, and the lizard. Do you see that my brain didn't remember? My brain was thinking of the spider that was out there. That's called Kim's Game. And you can play it with anything. Maybe you can play it with stationery. Glue, cokey pen, and pen. Right, are you ready? Take a photograph. Tell me what's there. There's glue, there's a pen, and a cokey pen. A glue, a pen, and a cokey pen. So you can play that and you can do it with so many things. You can even put five things. But here's something different. I'm putting glue, I'm putting cokey pen, and I'm putting a pen. Take a photograph with your eyes. I'm covering it up. Here comes the greedy guzzler. Here comes the greedy guzzler. And he's going to steal something. And you're not going to see what the greedy guzzler stole. What's missing? What's missing? What was over there? Are you right? Let's have a look. It was the glue. Excellent. Right, have a look. Take a photograph. And I'm covering it up. Here comes the greedy guzzler. The greedy guzzler is stealing. Let's see what he stole this time. Do you know what he stole? He stole the cokey pen. There we go. So you can play Kim's game and you can play what's missing with anybody at home who wants to play the game. All you need is a tray a cloth to hide things and anything to put on. So you were using your sense of sight. You were looking at it and see your eye was working hard to look, your brain was remembering and then your eye was looking to see what was missing or remembering what was there. Have fun playing Kim's game today or what's missing.